Aloha, bitches. It's your favorite internet shitlord, Oslo, here. Dragging you guys back to the dark side for some more baby back bullshit. We'll get the big memory out of the way first. Crashy cart. And you can't even make a mistake. If you make one mistake, it's normal difficulty. Oh dear mother of God, this is gonna be a fucking trip. Buckle up, boys. Make one mistake, you can't win the race. Fucking gay. It's so bad. Oh, what's wrong, DSP? You're, you're too much of a pussy ass bitch to say something's fucking gay? There's a lot of things that are fucking gay in this world. The fact that we'll never get a new Mad Max movie is fucking gay. Most of The Last Jedi? Eh, pretty fucking gay. Square Enix working on a shitty Marvel game and not a third Adam Jensen Deus Ex game? Pretty motherfucking gay. It's so badly made! The game is not badly made, you just fucking suck at it like most games so this is none of this should be a surprise roll the many clips of phil brunell sucking cock at a children's cart racer from the 90s damn it audacity you never like to cooperate with me where is he not even visible on my screen where did he go look how far ahead he is this is impossible oh wait i'm in first my god dsp is blind retarded or both how did he it's in the fucking bottom left corner in a big font first. You you should it's there so you can always see what place you're in. That's how a racing game works, you moron. I didn't even know I was in first. Look at this, there's nothing I can do. Now there's nothing I can do. Triple barrel squish. Oh shit, we just got the double. <sighs> nothing I could do. Oh, it's love the salt. Love it. Give me more salt. Give me more of it, please. What? You gotta be joking. How is that my fault? It's your fault because you hit the fucking wall, dude. It's pretty fucking cut and dry. I'm gonna lose now because of bullshit. I hit a wall. That's bullshit. A wall you can't see. No, the wall was always there, dude. Maybe your boomer ass reflexes uh, didn't register at a time and that's why you hit the wall. Or maybe because you need the glasses. I hit a wall I couldn't see so I get third. Fuck you. I couldn't even see it. You can't see it during the jump, so how you know it's there? Lame. Get glasses, sit closer to the TV, do what you gotta do, but everything was there. You just gotta see better. Eat some carrots. I don't fucking know, dude. Another one. <laughs> what? I lose all speed. Get the fuck out of here. Hold on a fucking minute, I think that's the same fucking wall. I'm gonna do a little Scooby-Doo research up in this shit, hang on. No, it's not the same spot, it's the same track though, which is kind of depressing because you'd think he would learn- You learn the track as you go in a kart racer, you, you learn where things are. You think he'd remember that, but DSP's brain only thinks about money and, uh, and gin and wrestle wrestle. Yeah, they- this never happens to your enemies, they always retain their speed. It's the game's fault, dude. Fucking degen. All right, round three with the walls. Let's see what happens. Uh, that's lame. Oh, what the? What? Oh, uh, they put a, a side of the, the tunnel that completely fucks you. I mean, it looks like it only fucks uh, mentally challenged, fat, gout-ridden Twitch streamers who beg for money all day on the internet. Because... No one else would have been that fucking stupid. He just rammed into the wall for a good few seconds and got dropped down to eighth, you foolish man baby. That's kind of stupid. I'm sorry, that's really fucking stupid. Is the game stupid or are you stupid? Because CTR is known for having some bomb ass track design and you're known for being a, a fucking idiot, so yeah. You guys think the wall is Phil's biggest enemy in this game? Oh no no no. It is clearly. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? Yup, darks to fill in ramps and crash team racing. Get along like uh, Phil and Cat in bed. Not well. All right, that is the Phil and Cat sex joke out of the way. Now let's get back to the man baby being upset he's spaghetti. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. Why doesn't the fucking ramp work? I've got all of this on camera. Why doesn't the fucking ramp work? <sighs> if 
we have you fucking up a ramp on camera and you almost having a mental breakdown over it. You had the, you were doing the, you, you look like you're about to have a bitch fit over it. It's only a game, dude. You don't have to be mad. Ah, oh, but this guy doesn't know when to give up, sadly. Wow! I jumped too! I jumped and the game fucked it up. Wow! That's twice! And I used the speed boost item! You would think if he kept fucking up on the ramp, he would just not take the ramp again. It's like that one part in Far Cry 3 where you're tied up by Voss and he's about to kick you into the fucking, like, ocean ravine cave thing and tells you the definition of insanity. The definition of insanity is insanity is doing the exact same fucking thing over and over again. Oh, shit. Shit that is crazy. The first time somebody told me that, I don't know if the revolution is so boom, I should. The thing is, <laughs> he was right. And then I started seeing everyone looked, everyone looked, all these fucking pricks. Everyone looked, doing the exact same fucking thing, over and over and over and over and over again. Thinking, this time, it's gonna be different. No, 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 please. This time, it's gonna be different. I'm sorry. I don't like the way you are looking at me. Okay? You have a fucking problem in your head. You don't push me, you think I'm lying. Fuck you! Okay, fuck you! It's okay, man. I'm gonna chill him, man. I'm gonna chill. The thing is, alright? The thing is, I killed you once, already. And it's not like I am fucking crazy. It's okay. It's like we're under the bridge. Did I ever tell you the definition of insanity? Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck you! God, Far Cry 3 is a good fucking game. You know what is also a good game? Blood Dragon. They should make a Blood Dragon 2. I dropped 60 bucks on that in a fucking heartbeat, Ubisoft. And I fucking hate Ubisoft. Except for Siege. Siege is pretty fun. We did it on the third attempt, so third time's the charm, I guess. Hey, me, do you have any more uh, funny ramp clips for the, for the cool video? Dang. What? You gotta be kidding me! The ramp didn't work! No, dumbass, you came in at a funny angle. Lost your speed, that's how you didn't hit the ramp, because you fucked up. The ramp didn't work! The ramp... The ramp failed! Yeah, we saw you fuck up the ramp, now we're all gonna move on. You fucked up in a video game, what else is new? Are you kidding me? The ramp didn't work. How could you tell me that's my fault? The ramp doesn't work. <laughs> what? I drive on the ramp with a speed boost on it. Somehow the ramp makes me not go fast enough to make the jump. That's my fault as the player. What the fuck? Phil just can't wrap his little dumb piggy mind around that he fucked up a ramp and he's so salty about it. Holy shit. Alright, what's next up on my chopping block? It's like they didn't even try. Let's just put something insanely unfair. Oh, by the way, he teleports in front of you when you're ahead of him for no reason. And, you know, this is fun for a kid. It's like, no, it's not. You're about to sadistic dumb fucks. This is terrible. Phil, it's a boss race. What do you fucking expect? Him to be nice and easy on you? Also, I played CTR as a kid. A bunch of other fucking people did. We got through it. It's not rocket science. And it's no Dark Souls, whatever fucking game faggot journalists want to claim. And retards like Phil. It's no Dark Souls. We gotta stop doing that, everybody. You know what games are like Dark Souls? The Surge? Uh, Lords of the Fallen? Other... That type of shit. Just because the game's hard doesn't mean it's like Dark Souls. Moral of the fucking story. Moving on. I don't get it. Maybe... Maybe I'm different from a lot of other people when it comes to what you're looking for in your games or whatever, but for me, like, this is just, you're punishing me. How is the game punishing you? By giving you somewhat of a challenge, you just can't breeze through it? Also, you guys remember in the last video when uh, Phil wanted to buy a Crash over Bloodstained? <sighs> Should've went with Bloodstained, dude. Moral of the story. Because I bought your game? Like, so I, I spent money to buy your game. Correction, you spent other people's money that you begged and play it, and now you're gonna fuck me in the ass? Like, thanks for buying our game now, can you bend over? That's like what this game is doing. This moment, definition of butthurt, right here. Textbook, butthurt. And I don't understand how that's a fun experience for people. Because people like the challenge, they like getting pushed to their fucking limits and then overcoming it after so long. That's why I love shit like Super Meat Boy, because I can sit there for like 45 minutes, die to a fucking saw blade, but when I beat the level, 
Oh, I feel like I'm on top of the fucking world. Mount Everest ain't nothing to fuck with when you beat Super Meat Boy level. Just because I'm here and I'm angry at a game that was made unfairly doesn't mean that it's going to pay off for me in any way, shape, or form. First point, CTR is a well-designed kart racer. That's why it's been revered for so fucking long. Also, people come to see you rage and get upsetty spaghetti over video games. They come to see you for shit like this. <laughs> nothing I could do! There's nothing I could do! What is going on? Look! What? What the fuck? I got hit by invisible items twice! Twice! How is this fun? Oh, this is a great racing game. No, it's not. This is one of the worst I've ever played. I just get co completely double fucking juggled at the end of a fucking stage when I'm in first. Double juggled by invisible items. This is a good game. Fuck this game. I'm in first place. Oh, item, 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 item. Now you're in fifth. Fuck you. I keep telling you guys that viewers on Twitch don't mean anything. I've said that a million times. Hold the fucking phone. Twitch, your main platform, the viewerships on there don't fucking matter? So now YouTube doesn't matter at all, according to him. Twitch viewers don't matter at all. All that matter are the Twitch pay piggies and the pay me ton pay piggies. Only thing that matters are the people that give him money. Fuck, I feel mad scummy after hearing that. What's the next clip? People want to see the rarity of the trophies. Oh yeah? The best way to see the trophies is actually from the trophy screen over here. Oh, why don't you get a job? That's why people wanted to see it. Why don't you get a job? I do have a job. That was only a bronze? You fucking piece of shit. Why the fuck does an inept gamer like Phil Burnell care about achievements? Also, it's not a job where you have to beg your fan base constantly for money. Get a fucking job, Phil. Alice also did a video with Cheers, so why did I get time for saying hey YouTube when you were doing your YouTube intro? But that's not what you were saying hey YouTube for, it's stupid, and we all know that. No, you fucking don't. You're just so goddamn paranoid about people. You think everything's a negative detractor bully jerk meme against you. Don't try to play dumb. <laughs> you think that we're all stupid, we're not. We're much smarter. Come on. Come on, Phil. Don't fuck with us like that. <laughs> you silly fucking goose. We've all been in your chat. We know what goes on, and there's a bunch of wheelchair symbols. Max level wheelchairs. Let's hope we can find a smarter clip here. Someone impersonating Tutankhamen and Timmy Dow. You guys all remember King Tut. He was the whale pay piggy that got beefing with swagons and then eventually left. He was the pay piggy before Emerald 7. If you're mad at, are you mad at me? I'll contribute if you give me a second chance. Dude, you're, you're free to contribute, but you're not you're never coming back to the stream chat. This fucking asshole. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, you can give me money, but you just can't interact with my other fans or chatters in my stream chat. Because <laughs> you distracted my stream chat and made the stream, the stream is all about you. Perhaps because Tut is more entertaining and compelling than you are. And uh, in addition, you tried to charge back <coughs> all the things you ever contributed on stream anyway. So you're an asshole. So, fuck off. Beginning of this 24 second clip. <laughs> Yeah, King Tut, you can come back and give me money, but don't come in my stream chat. End of the 24 second clip. <sighs> Fuck you, Tut. How wildly inconsistent can you be, Phil? You flip-flop so much, you should be at the beach. Oh wait, you can't afford to live at the beach. Alright, I got one more clip in Crashy Car, then we're gonna move on. After a while, I realized it was too much of a hassle to have a mug up here and pour the water in to drink it, when I can just chew the bottle, you know? Holy shit, DSP is so fucking inept. So... Too, it's too much work for him to pour water into a mug to take a sip out of. He has to use a ba a bottle like a fucking baby. That doesn't explain why you crunch it into the mic like a fucking degenerate, though. A little advice, uh, get a glass water bottle. They're pretty fucking neat. And uh, instead of the crunching thing, the worst thing you get is a, a fun little poppa noise. Yeah, I just took a slip like a sleazy asshole, so what? I think that's all I got for a Crashy Cart. Moral of the story, overall, he fucking hates the game. He's probably going to drop it the second he can. Should have bought in Bloodstain. I think I have one more clip here unrelated to Crashy Cart. Let's check that out. Yo, you fucking suck. <laughs> yes, I fucking suck. Very nice. I fucking suck. Well, I'm glad you can admit that, Phil. The first step to recovery is admitting 
that you fucking suck at video games. Second step is getting a fucking job. <laughs> Taste the salt. <laughs> Very nice. That just makes it all the more delicious. Yes. That was good stuff. <laughs> Taste it. Taste it. More fucking proof that Darks the Phil cannot take a fucking L or a W to save his life. And if the situation was reversed, where he got his ass kicked, like usually happens, he'd sit there and go, The game is unfair, dudes. It was lag. And that's pretty much it for me. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got this, uh, I got this great fan interaction between Phil and uh, Mr. Papavera. Mr. Minecraft guy who's been giving Phil like all the hand holding his way through his Minecraft let's play pretty much. All right, I got two questions right now. One, why is this guy, Papa Vera, so insane to make a Minecraft forum guide just for Darks to Phil's shit tier playthrough of Minecraft? All right, that's my first question. Question two, why does Phil just respond with the word done like a fucking space sale? It's more proof that staying in that office of his all day long and not leaving his house is fucking with his head. It's screwing him the fuck up. Oh, last thing. Phil got over four grand in tips so far this month. Will he still beg? Probably. Will this momentum carry him farther into the summer bummer drama arc? No. I don't think it's going to keep going. I think it's going to stop at the end of this month and get slow in the summer. And he's going to bitch. Be like, it's so slow during the summer, dudes. Unless Dave keeps pulling his little stunts he's been pulling over the last few months. Like punching down to pro Jared and punching up to Dr. Disrespect to keep the pay piggies talking. I.e. interacting with him. Then he's going to gonna be struggling. He's going to need to do some stunts. Stunts. And uh, that's it for me. Thank you for watching this video. It means a lot. If you want to hear me talk about other things that is not DSP related, I do a show on the weekends called Base Buddies with my buddy. Here's a clip. Just like just All the spoons. spoons. No, we're spoons. It's, just... yeah, it's, a, it's a special little show. I'll tell, I'll give it that. You ever want to call me a dumbass? You can do it on my Twitter at Base Oslo. I also have a Discord. All the links can be found in the description below. Okay, you guys be safe. Make good choices.